On a regular fall day, I could be swimming right here where I'm standing. But drought conditions in September and all the way into October mean water levels are incredibly low here at Alouette Lake. Alouette Lake in Golden Ears Provincial Park, normally a haven for swimmers and boaters. These bone dry conditions are so extreme, the buoys normally floating in the middle of the lake are sitting on dry land. Honestly, it's way up there that it's usually the, the, the shoreline, and these are in the middle. I, I mean, it takes me a good five minutes to swim out to this. Water levels this low can threaten the fish and animals that use these waterways. BC also depends on the water from these lakes to generate hydroelectric energy. Alouette Lake is actually a reservoir managed by BC Hydro, and it sends water to two key places. First of all, to Alouette River for a salmon habitat, and two, through this dam to go on to generate power. But BC Hydro says right now water levels are so low, they're sending less water through here to create power so they can prioritize enough water to keep those salmon alive. BC Hydro said in a statement, managing reservoir levels is a normal procedure for our system of dams and reservoirs throughout the province, and that based on our modelling, we project being able to continue to maintain fish flows into the Alouette River. It's kind of hard to imagine that the energy situation and the energy generation capacity would not be impacted. Experts say more periods of prolonged drought could eventually spell trouble for BC's energy supply. There is a long-term concern about energy security as a result of these droughts, and we know that moving into the future, uh, based on climate change, we're anticipating there will be more hotter and drier uh, summers, prolonged uh, periods of drought uh, down the road. So it's not just what's happening right now. These conditions will also make this landscape more prone to flooding when the wet weather returns. Though for now, with rain finally in the forecast, there's relief this reservoir may soon fill up. It's concerning and it's well worth praying for and we'll be glad when the river starts uh, filling up and the lake starts filling up and we've got rain again. With hopes BC won't go from drought to floods in just a few weeks. Michelle Gassoub, CBC News, Maple Ridge.